This new TV show called Paid Off helps people pay off their student loans and hopes to trigger a wider conversation about the problem. It looks like fun and games, but student debt in America is no joke. $42,017 in debt. Roughly 44 million, or one in four Americans, has student debt, and that number is growing at over 10 percent per year. Student debt in the U.S. now stands at almost $1.5 trillion, with U.S. graduates carrying an average debt load of more than $37,000. These statistics are all too real for 32-year-old Sheena Demby, who works as a wholesale operations manager in the fashion industry in New York. She has $300,000 in student loans. Half of my check, almost two-thirds of my check, goes to paying student loans every single month. I can't afford to save. I can't afford to invest. There are times when I'm still eating, like, your ramen noodles and your dollar pizza. It's hard. How did Demby and so many other Americans get here? Well, tuition is rising. The cost of a college degree today is about twice what it was two decades ago. At the same time, there is less money available for financial aid and scholarships. Looking at this as a 17-year-old, 18-year-old, what are you going to do? You're going to sit there and say, no, I'm not going to get an education. Every single job out there tells you you need to have a college education. Demby says she certainly felt the pressure to get a degree at any cost. Everybody's pushing you, finish, get your degree. You gotta finish school, you gotta do this, you gotta do that. Nobody at any point is saying, if you do this, when you leave, job or not, you will be in debt. You will be in a lot of debt. Brodsky says Americans have very low rates of financial literacy. Many don't fully comprehend the concept of compound interest. So when you look at this and you say like, okay, I'm going to take out a $50,000 loan for my education, you don't understand that that actually means you're paying back $100,000 over the next 20 years or more, depending on the interest rate you got. A recent study predicts recent graduates will have to delay retirement to 75, in part because of the burden of student debt. Demby feels trapped by her predicament. For the moment, she's pinning her hopes on becoming a contestant on Paid Off. Karina Huber, CGTN, New York.